Okay, this is standard eight. We're going to be looking at macros. Now, macros are a way that you can automate something that you do on a regular basis. So in this example, maybe you get a report every week you have to uh, reformat. You get it from an associate. You have to reformat it. Maybe you're getting a couple of them. And you know that your boss has a particular style they like to see. Bosses can be funny like that. They can have a particular way they like to see things. We are going to be creating a macro. We're going to change this and so that next week when you get all the reports you're going to be able to just click a little button and it's going to automatically format it for you so you don't have to change this from week to week. Okay to record our macro we're going to go to the view tab and I have the macros right here. I can view macros that are currently in the document if, if you've created any more you'll find those there or I can record a macro. So I'm going to name this weekly format and don't make the mistake I was making well, the misspelling too. Uh, you can't put a space in here, as I'm finding out. So I'm going to assign this to a button. I could also assign it to a keyboard shortcut. We're going to start with a button here just for fun. Okay, this is customizing my quick access toolbar. So all the things I have up here, I have save, I have undo, redo, all these buttons. I'm here in my word options, and I can add this new macro. Let's add it here. Let's modify it, and I'm going to put a picture of the crazy boss up here. So now I know what I'm finding up here. I click OK. So this is my new macro. It's currently recording. You can see the, the button down here. It's currently recording, and I've also got my picture of the crazy boss up here when I go to run it later. So maybe I know that crazy boss likes salary data differently. I'm going to come here to my home tab, and he likes it in bold, bigger. And maybe doesn't like that in the blue color, just wants it in black. I'm going to highlight my table. Maybe go to my design tab. He doesn't like the color green. He's kind of a blue guy. I can make the different changes I want to. I can make my first column here see how that's bolded or not. Uh, so there I've got that. He maybe wants some different shading, different border styles around the whole table. Whatever it is you're going to do, when you're done, let's go back up into our view. Go to our macros and let's stop recording our macro. Okay, now I have this macro, it is all assigned. And once that is assigned, I can just every week when I get the report from all my coworkers go up, I will click on the button up here. I will have the macro assigned and I won't have any difficulties with formatting that every week.